The Land Commission says it has interdicted 10 of its employees who have been busted by the National Intelligence Bureau for stealing more than 100 million cities. The employees are alleged to be part of a 21-member gang which conspired to manipulate the software of the commission, enabling it to generate fixed term duties and steal money the commission was to pay to the Ghana Revenue Authority. Deputy Executive Secretary Jones of Uribuidi says the software has been immediately secured to prevent further theft. He's been speaking at a news conference. We are still investigating. I know the matter is before the uh, NIB and they are also investigating. So we cannot put a figure to how much is involved because it is still evolving. Um, the software, I must say that um, we, we developed that software in-house, the Enterprise Land Information System was developed in-house and we've used that, you know, in our processes and it's been, it's been quite effective. Now, what we've done after we discovered this is to um, move that platform to um, a firm to to move the management of the platform to a firm to manage it for us so that would help us to safeguard you know some of these more practices but that is in the interim in the long term what we intend to do as part of the land, land reform project that we're doing at the Lands Commission is to change the entire software. Currently, we're operating on um, an open source software platform, but we want to move it to a proprietary um, software platform when we start the, the land reform project. So that is in the long term. But in the interim, we've moved the platform to um, a, a, a firm who is managing it for us now. So it's not the in-house team that is managing it anymore.